action now turns to the gold medal match as the coaches make their way out onto the shooting line. We await the athletes. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the athletes to the field for the Vicar Women gold medal match. On target number one, representing Germany, Katharina Bauer. <laughs> On target number two, representing Turkey, Gülnaz Büşanur Joshua. <laughs> and the line judge for this match is Irfan Çalış. So on target number one, Katarina Katarina Bauer, Bauer she was Germany's first 26 on year one. years old. She was fourth at the indoor series finals and is here on great form, shooting the best ranking round of 657 to be seeded first for the knockout stages. 22-year-old Gulnaz Koskin of Turkey is her opponent. She won the bronze medal at the 2018 European Championships, but it will be Bauer to get the gold medal match for recurve women's underway. Nine points. Eight points. with this last arrow then for Koskun. Oh, that felt like a very eight long point. hold. It's drifted off into the eight for a 25 and the set points go to the German. Of course, always subject to uh, the target judge's confirmation. But a long hold there, Nikki. Yeah, it really was. Uh, perhaps knowing that you know ten, the last nine, arrow ten. of the set and it may well have made the difference between a, a win or a loss of the set. But yeah, you just got to keep the shot flowing. It's really important. And you know, you look at Bauer. Her shot is lovely and simple. It's got flow. Um, she's just not holding it long, a long time at full draw. So yeah, really nice to see. Really lovely technique. Well, the Turkish fans look on. Early stages, but uh, their athlete struggling a little bit here. But put under pressure with a 10 from Bauer with a third arrow of that first set. And the German leads by two set points to nil. But can change round very quickly. Curve archery. Gunas Bishranu Joshkun shoot first on target number two. Set two of the recurve women's gold medal match here at the Spring Arrows in Antalya and its home soil's very own. Gunas Koskin will shoot first, trailing by two set points to nil. to apply some pressure there, Koskin, but Bauer is soaking this one up, a 10 to get things underway for her. Ten 
on hold again. You can hear the coach in the box just counting her down. Only 20 seconds to shoot these arrows. Very different from Bauer. Just moving through the shot. A lot quicker with her shot timing. So all square again after two arrows each. But this time Koskin gets to shoot first and put the pressure on. Nine points. She's with a nine. There's a little bit of uh, look like seesawing there on the uh, clicker. Eight nine nine. Now, interesting. Has that hit the line? It's marked as an eight for now. Really close. Let's see. I think, you know, uh, too close to call from nine. here. Nine. Twenty eight. Look on, it looks like it might well get marked up to a nine. This, I wonder if that's a little bit of a, a consolation smile from uh, Koskin. I believe it has been we marked up. So Koskin shooting first, an indicator there that the points were shared. So it looks like we're at 3 1. And it will be the Turkish archer to shoot first, sharing the points in the second set. from Koskin and that has gone out to the left and I wonder if she was distracted by that markup in the last set. Nine points. Four to nine, very close. Speed at which Bauer's shooting as well, maybe put a bit more pressure on Koskin, she hasn't got much time to reset, start nine again, points. 20 seconds to shoot. Speed of Bauer has been consistent all through this match. Nine points. Seven points. Uh, all over the shop here in this one, a 23 to finish for Koskin. Very, very gettable here by Bauer and a 10 to finish things off no for a 28 and the points are all for the German but that uh, split in the second means that this match is still alive you talk about pressure of uh, the speed of shooting I mean just put that into context I mean what kind of effort how much weight are these guys pulling and how much recovery time do you need between shots yeah, so difficult to say exactly what they're pulling. So poundage-wise, uh, women internationally are probably shooting around the mid-40 pounds mark. Uh, you know, that might not sound a lot, but after repetition of doing this a lot, uh, that, that that stacks up. And the other thing is Koskin is holding that for probably around 10 seconds, she seems to be at full draw for, which is quite a long time. Um, and then with Bauer shooting so quickly, the clock switches straight back to Koskin again. So she's got to reset, reload. Um, your arms feel like the blood's drained out of them. And it is nice to have a deep breath, a few, five seconds or so just to recover. Um, but in this case, I don't think Koskin's getting that much chance. Well, it will be the Turkish archer who will shoot first, trailing 5-1 this fourth set is a must win for her the length of her hold when she's at full draw has been a feature of this match so far can she improve her process 
Well, that looked a bit quicker. Yeah, it certainly was a bit quicker. Nine points. Let's see if she can repeat it. Nine points. Fairly good again and grouped nicely, just a little bit left. We saw the wind uh, just moving the hair a little bit as well, so we know there's a little bit of a breeze in that stadium. Eight points. Uh, she needs to put that to one side for now. Kaskin wants to put some pressure on with a big score here. She's Eight drifted points. further out. I mean, the grouping is not bad, but it's in the eight for a 25. So, a 25 is all that's required from Bauer. So, seven will do this. Oh, she plonks it into the 10 for a 27. And, uh, well, a near perfect victory for her. Seven points to one for the gold medal here in Antalya.